ChatGPT. 42% product managers are female, and guess what? It has improved significantly compared to five years ago, that was only 32%. When I started my product management career, I was frequently the only woman in the meeting room and a very competitive environment. Now I'm so happy to see the number of female representation has increased. However, there's still lots of women, they are underpaid and they're afraid to ask more, and they are scared about the current economical environment, should they have kids or not, it's going to impact their work or not. So women are facing unique challenges. However, today I want to celebrate that we have a lot of unique strengths that we should leverage to make ourselves a great product manager. In this video, I'm going to tell you why women are great product manager and how can we turn strengths into our unique competitive advantage. Make sure to stay until the end of this video to get the free VIP access to the exclusive Zoom call with a VP of product at Google. Hey guys, this is Dr. Nancy Lee, a direct product and featured in Forbes. I've helped 100 people land their dream job offer in fan companies and unicorn startup and continue to get promoted as a product leader. If you want to take a product management course, please go to pmaccelerator.io to learn more. To learn the most effective way to become a product manager, please like and subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell button to be notified every time I publish a new video every Wednesday. First of all, let's understand what is the strength focused growth strategy. Everyone was born with certain type of strengths and certain type of weakness. But if you focus on improving your weakness, it will take a long time to get to where you are. But if you focus on leveraging your strengths, you can accelerate your career. And LinkedIn did research showing that 69% employees saying that if they're using the strengths into their day-to-day -day work, and they feel super engaged and they can produce even more outcome. Let me give you a specific example regarding how I choose strengths versus weakness. For example, one of my strengths is public speaking, but my weakness is writing skills. So therefore, when I started teaching people product management, I choose specifically focus on YouTube so that people know who I am, fell in love with my personality, and understand the amazing value I can bring in. And I frequently receive so many emails from people just watching my YouTube channel saying that, wow, Nancy, I watched a remote product manager video and I land a remote PM job. Your video changed my life. And this really touched my heart. I wanna see more video like this, so please, guys, send me more emails. And however, if I focus on using my weakness, which is my writing skills, I don't think lots of you guys really appreciate who I am and understand my true talent because I literally have so many typos, writing is not my strengths. So therefore, for lots of women out there, there are lots of strengths you can direct tap into right now to become a great product manager, but you didn't know that was your strength until you watched this video. Now, let me break it down for you. The most important characteristic of women is customer empathy. We have women are made of water, we are very emotional, and we have a big heart, we care about everybody. That's why this made us a great product manager because we naturally understand the nuances of people's pain point. We naturally care about our customer's pain point. And sometimes I even cry when I talk about my nonprofit mission, the people I really care about, talk about how my students are making progress and have breaking those glass ceilings. And that's why women are great as product manager because we fall in love with our customers just like this. All of me loves all of you. The second characteristic make women a great product manager is collaboration and relationship building. Women are frequently very collaborative and we do not like conflict. We really want to include everybody. So therefore, we are the best person who is able to align all the missions and goals with all the cross-functional teams and make sure everybody moves towards the same direction. However, at home, you might be slightly different. You might have very tough conversation with your husband, but we are very different at work. We are the most pleasant person in the team. We want to make sure that everyone's idea and voice are heard. Who doesn't want to work for us? Beautiful, smart, intelligent, and funny. Do you agree with me that women are born to be a great product manager? Comment down below. The third characteristic makes women great product managers is adaptability. Women were born and trained and naturally grew into 
of the capacity being able to adapt to many things in the changing circumstances and continue to push through. For example, we're born a little girl, then start dating and become someone's wife, and all of a sudden become a mom of two kids. We're constantly adapting in these new roles, new responsibilities, wearing multiple hats, and growing bigger team, bigger family. And we always feel so stressed out when we grow into the next level, but we're able to quickly adapt and adjust to the new environment and become the best of ourselves. And women are also very big in self-development and growing ourselves and gaining more skills so that we can continue to master new capabilities to help ourselves, our team, and our family to grow. And in the product management space, it's very similar because the competition is very severe and the market continues to change and there's lots of moving part in building a product from end to end. So therefore, women are very good at adapting into a new changing environment in the product management space. So we know how to master the process of launching an amazing product. Quick announcement, the VP of product at Google, Robert Lathan, is gonna speak on my Product Insider podcast. You're able to get a free VIP ticket to have an exclusive Zoom call with him during the Q&A towards the end of the podcast. And you can join my inner circle for free right now by getting this free VIP ticket. I'm gonna link in the description and also show, go to this website to join the inner circle for free right now to get a free Zoom call with a VP of product. If you're also a woman in product, I'd love you to share this video and invite more women into product management space. Let's grow these communities together. If you're preparing for product management interview, make sure to go to this playlist and check out this free sample answer to get ready for your next job offer. If you like the free tips we provide today, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more tips. This is Dr. Nancy from PM. Exercise.io. I'm gonna see you in my next video. Bye guys.